पार्टी ने एक परिवर्तन का जो काम मुझे दिया है मैं उस पर सही प्रकार से उतर पाऊँ ऐसा मेरा प्रयास रहेगा पहले भी राजनीतिक क्षेत्र में काम किया है जम्मू के महापौर के नाते भी काम किया है पार्टी में भी विभिन्न संगठन के पदों पर काम किया है अभी भी एक अध्यक्ष के नाते काम कर रहा था आगे भी जम्मू कश्मीर विशेष करके जम्मू कश्मीर और लद्दाख तीनों के लिए काम कर पाऊँ इस प्रकार की हमारी प्राथमिकता रहे Actor turned politician Kamal Hassan is all set to officially launch the much talked about whistleblowers app. In a promo video that runs for a little over a minute, Kamal Hassan urges active citizens to take a look at their surroundings and expose corruption in their area. The YSR Congress party has decided to expose Chief Minister N Chandra Babu Naidu's politics of deceit on the special category status by observing April 30th as Betrayal Day in Visakhapatnam. TDP Supremo Chandra Babu Naidu is to address the public meeting later today in Tirupati. The meeting is aimed at exposing the injustice done to the state by the BJP government and violation of promises given by the Prime Minister. The Arumugam Swami Commission inquiry into the death of the late Chief Minister Jay Jay Lalitha has summoned seven persons, including four IPS officers, for cross-examination. The commission has summoned former DJP K Ramanjunam, DGP of Tamil Nadu Uniform Services, the Director General of Police and Inspector General of Police. Rapist Asaram and both of the co-accused lawyers are likely to file an application of suspension of sentence against the punishment given to them for raping a minor girl. Prime Minister Narendra Modi will inaugurate the Buddha Jayanti celebrations. organized by the Ministry of Culture in collaboration with the International Buddhist Confederation later today the prime minister along with other dignitaries will pay their respects to the sacred relics after being caught making series of controversial statements tripura cm biplab kumar deb was summoned by prime minister narendra modi for a meet in the national capital on may 2nd deb advised the youth of his state to not run for after politicians for government jobs and instead milk cows and open pawn shops it is over half an hour address at the jana krosh rally gandhi launched an all out attack on prime minister narendra modi on issues of law and order double standards on corruption messing up of the economy undermining democratic institutions and what he said is failing to provide safety to women Telangana Chief Minister and the Telangana Rashtra Samiti Supremo K Chandrasekhar Rao reached out to the Dravida Munnetra Kazagam DMK leadership in his bid to stitch a federal front for 2019 general elections. First KCR visited DMK President M Karunanidhi at his Gopalpuram residence and sought his blessings. A journalist of a TV news channel who was covering Congress President Rahul Gandhi's Jan Akrosh rally at the Ram Leela Maidan was heckled by congress supporters the journalist was reporting about the apparent shortfall in the crowd by showing empty seats at the rally andhra pradesh ruling party tdp will hold a public meeting later today against the prime minister over its failure to grant special category status to the state Ahead of a cabinet reshuffle, Jammu and Kashmir Deputy Chief Minister Nirmal Singh tendered his resignation to pave the way for Assembly Speaker Kavinder Gupta to take over the post in the PDP BJP government led by Chief Minister Mehbooba Mufti. Bihar Chief Minister Nitish Kumar urged Prime Minister Modi to confer the Bharat Ratna, the highest civilian award in the country, on socialist leader Ram Manohar Lohia. In a three-page letter addressed to the Prime Minister, Kumar drew Modi's attention towards lohia's role in the struggle for independence aap government's ambitious project to provide free wifi services to delhi residents continues to remain stuck at its public works department the department has expressed inability to implement the scheme citing a lack of expertise home minister rajnath singh said that the constitutional posts must be respected and their propriety should not be questioned amid a raging debate over a demand by a few opposition parties led by the congress to impeach chief justice of india the home minister said congress president rahul gandhi is doing politics over non issues 
taking a dig at the extended family of jail leader Sashikala. Tamil Nadu Chief Minister K. Palani Swami said both the parties floated by her kin would disappear from the political scene soon. Hardly within two months of Sashikala's nephew TTV Dinakaran forming a party, it had already witnessed a split, he said.